Hey readers, this is Palin the Librarian with today's book review. Too Bright to See by Kyle Luckoff. It's a um, first novel for this author and I was very pleased. I picked it up particularly for the size. I know that's weird, but a lot of my readers in my libraries don't like huge books and so I was hoping this would attract them. It is a story about a child named Bug. <laughs> love the nickname because that's what I call my daughter anyway, whose uncle with whom she had been living along with her mother has passed away. And it is the, the, the summer following his death um, in which this story takes place. They live in a house that Bug and her uncle have always thought of as haunted. And after his death, she, be she believes that his spirit is still lingering in the house. So, so it's sort of this spooky little ghost story. And I do not want to give away any spoilers here, so I'm not going to. But it's, the story goes much beyond a spooky little ghost story. It is about finding who you are. Um, it is a little bit mature, um, even though the size looked like it might be okay for like third graders or whatever. Um, it's, it's a bit mature in storyline. I'll just leave it at that. Um, I think great for middle school and I'm seriously considering it, carrying it for my upper elementary. My fifth graders, I think, will love this and be able to understand it in its maturity and content. Uh, too bright to see by Kyle Luckoff. Whatever you're reading, keep reading.